What's happening guys, The Fine Lens here and today we're talking about how you can remove any type of noise in your videos. No, I'm not talking about that noise, I'm talking about this noise. So it has come to my attention that a lot of people struggle with noise in low light conditions. And the thing is, not all cameras can handle an ISO of more than 400 without producing too much noise. Any camera that can do that is most likely too expensive for the average user. My camera as well, I can't shoot anything higher than 400, so I need to still reduce noise and fix everything in post-production. But that's what this video is all about, so let's stop wasting time and dive right into the tutorial. I've imported everything into After Effects, head over to your Effects and Presets channel, type in Noise and drag the Denoiser effect into your footage. This is going to bring up a few settings, just up the Reduce Noise, I usually up that to around 45-50, in this case 45 sound right. And then the smoothness of your colors, you can up that quite a bit to around, I'd say, 70, 80. And then always preserve details. So you're going to play around with the denoise and the preserve detail to get the correct balance. Sharpening is definitely a must. I usually sharpen to around 30, 36. So the sharpness, I'm going to take that down to about 27. And noise, I'll reduce almost 90%. So I think those changes are looking pretty good. You can see around my nose, the noise has really been reduced there and especially in the black areas, there was a lot of noise but everything has disappeared. So this is an amazing plugin. And the next clip is just of my Fotix light box. There's a lot of noise on the darker areas and also on the blues. So copying that plugin, just hit Control plus C to copy it and paste it over to your next video clip and you'll see it's going to immediately take in that settings and immediately reduce all those noise. Now you can just go place that effect on all of your video clips, make sure that the details are preserved and that you don't lose too much details when it comes to reducing noise. So play around with those settings and make sure that everything balances themselves out. That's going to be perfect. So that is it for the tutorial, I think the final result came out pretty good, just remember you're not going to save all your footage, especially if the ISO was extremely high, but using this tutorial is definitely going to help you in reducing most of that noise. And that being said, leave a comment down below if you've got any questions, leave a like on this video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And as always, be defined.